He's great. Uh, I think he's going to do really well. He was a very, very uh, elite wrestler, and I think it's going to cross over really well. I, I know Donovan Beard's only a 7-1 fighter who's not even in the UFC yet, but were you surprised to see him just run right through him and, and just, you know, it seems like he's got all, all his skills up to par, so to speak. Uh, no, I wasn't. I knew it's going to take someone really, really good to, to stop Bo Nichols. You know, I, I wasn't anticipating too much resistance out of, I, I, I can't say I knew Donovan Beard at all, <laughs> but, um, yeah, I had no, I wasn't expecting a lot of resistance out of him. And I know it's early, but do you see that championship pedigree at a Bo Nickel already? Like people are saying that, that, you know, this is a guy that can immediately make an impact. Yeah, I think so. I don't know how long it's going to take him to get there. Obviously, like, you know, I, it's funny because I literally just talked about this. I said something like, um, you know, it's like it's going to take him multiple years to to try to get a title shot. And because with fighting, it's hard because it's like you can get in there every month um, and you never know when injuries happen, you know. And so then, you know, right off the bat, his his December debut got moved to March because of an injury, right? And that's in fighting that's what happens and who knows maybe there'll be another injury or maybe something will happen someone gets sick or an opponent drops out there's just so many things so it's like it's really hard to rush it